It's the worst when you've done nothing to provoke it. Just on the wrong road at the wrong time. A postcode you're apparently not allowed to enter because it's an area only an exclusive few are meant to. Always them saying, never seen you here before, bruv. Or, I've seen you rolling with them, man. Or, who told you you can come through these ends, you dickhead? Always you replying, I'm just trying to get home. Or, nah, I don't want no beef. Or, nah, allow me. I'm tight with your boy X, Y, and Z. But they don't give a fuck who you know, what you're on, if you're telling the truth or if you're lying. Because their environment has always taught them to corner a gazelle and they'll be better off looking like the lion. Try to run away, dash past man before the situation escalates. Nah, no, I'm you again, no way, man, they're holding back, let me introduce him to the blade. One brother filming a 10 inch Rambo pressed against my neck. Because now, a video of someone's humiliation is considered laughable content. But this ain't content, it's real life, so if I say the wrong word, it's this life I'll be leaving. It's that knife seeping deeper into my stomach and I hear nothing but my heart beating. Random flashing thoughts like, how can I ever get intimate with a girl again? After she undresses me and she judges me and she glances at this battle scar. Why am I calling this a battle scar as if I'm some World War II veteran? Well, the reality is I couldn't even put up a fight like, rah, why, who, what, how, wait, why, who, what, how, no, why, who, what, stop, stop, this. This is fucking killing me. I'm dying. Her whole body's been so numb to the fact that they actually put the blade through. And it went so easy. Something I thought so much for a liar, I thought felt so much more liar in films and TV, so the panic of smiling, quivering, lying on a cold pavement. It's got me feeling all kinds of crud, holding my guts, filling my pockets with nothing but blood, scrambling to find a phone which they obviously teethed and ducked to whereabouts unknown. I just want to call my loved ones and put my heart out of the sleeve. But instead, I'm spreading my crimson feet on a great pair of jeans. Someone help me. I don't want to go. I don't want to die so young, please. I'd give anything not to have this Grim Reaper on my tongue. Waiting for an ambulance called by a bystander applying pressure, knowing full well not every victim is lucky. So for every second I've got up in a fight to survive tonight. Share my pain, discourage others carrying. Using the reality of what it could feel like to go through this ain't fuckery. Ain't ever gonna give up on seeing a better tomorrow. We're more and more encouraged to understand the potential to thrive in society and just drop their fucking knives. I'm fighting for not just mine, but for our future. Because it's never been clearer that London and the rest of the world needs us alive. <laughs>